Hello. Um, I thought I'd recorded all this, but apparently I hit the wrong button. Well done, Rochelle. Anyhow, this is the first day of the four weeks of lockdown in New Zealand. So I'm doing this from home for obvious reasons. Now, we are a family of four with two cats. We've got two teenage boys, uh, my husband and myself. Husband's going to be working from home. Not that he has a choice on this because he's not essential personnel. None of us are. And he'll be working out in his studio, or games room, is the official name for it. Um, now, in this four weeks, basically we were allowed to go out and get food. We will probably be getting it from the supermarket because going by an email I got last night from the greengrocer, one of our greengrocers, the greengrocers are all going to be shut down because you can still get green, gross, green stuff from the supermarket. This is despite the fact that the supermarket stuff tends to be worse quality and higher priced. I think the supermarkets are going to be loving this. They're rubbing their hands all the way to the bank. Never mind. Let's hope that all the greengrocers actually survive the experience because our little local one has only been open for about a year. Um, it's a little family run business and really friendly, really helpful. And just as an example, their salary is twice the size of the supermarket stuff and much, much nicer. Never mind. I suspect I will have to give up the salary juice for the duration of this because I'm not going to be going out every couple of days to get more salary. Um, not if I can't go to the local greengrocer. So that's life at the moment. Um, now, as far as plans for this period are concerned, I've got my sewing, I've got my knitting. Um, how much of each I can do will depend on how my elbows cope, because I also have cubital tunnel in both elbows. No joy. Um, I will also be working on my grandmother's chair, which is here. So, oop, hard doing this this way. Actually, I'm just going to flip this round. I can. No, I can't flip this around. It doesn't work so well with this. Okay. Right. So, this is my grandmother's chair. You see that blue bit? And the white bit there. Okay. That is the new back. Um, the rest of it, if we get rid of, pull that up, you can see I've resprung it. And we've got the finger stuff around the edge. The next step is to pad it out. So I've got some one horsetail, can't get any more. And I've got a whole lot of coarse sheep's wool, which I'm going to be hand carding and then putting in place on there. Um, I've also got to repaint a bit. It got left in the conservatory. And the conservative gets super hot and someone, I know who, but I'm not going to name them, put a Swiss ball on top of it and it melted some of the paint onto the Swiss ball. Luckily, I picked up some new paint the other day at Bunnings. Um, wanted to go to Mitre 10, support local, but unfortunately everyone else was doing that and I couldn't get a park. So I ended up at Bunnings. Just as well because you can't go to Bunnings anymore unless you're tradie. And we're not tradies. So that's one thing I'll be working on. I've already done some cutting out. I've got two pairs of trousers cut out for my husband. And I'm partway through cutting out a shirt for him as well. I've also cut out two tops for me. Including a winter top for, from some hand dyed merino that I bought from someone. Um... I'm going to be doing a whole lot of cutting out, so I've got plenty of sewing so that my husband can then use what I use as the cutting out table, which is actually his games table, for work, because that's actually got a big whiteboard as its top, so he can then use that. Aside from that, we've got a few things to do around the house, or rather I do, because he's obviously going to be working, at least if he wants to get paid, which we kind of need. Um, I'm going to be doing some weeding, the veggie patches. Oh, a bit messy. Um, and we're going to need spinach and 
letters and stuff that's in there. Um, and I'm also going to be cleaning the secondary loo. So in this house we've got two loos. We've got one in a separate room, which is the one that I use. And then we've got one, the one in the bathroom, which is the one that most of the boys in the household use to go for a wee. And unfortunately, their aim ain't so good. So the loo is starting to smell, and of course it's caught in the back where everything's all put together. So I'm going to take that to pieces. This is something I do on a regular basis. Because it's a fine day today. Clean it up, get it dry, put it back together again. And then when I have a bath, I'm not going to be smelling wee. Which would be much nicer. So, and I'm also going to set up the exercise resistance thing in the garage, which arrived yesterday morning and has now had 24 hours sitting in its cardboard box without being touched. Um, so it's like it's like a TRX, but about half the price. And shift the last of the wool that I can fit into the new bed base. Because we recently got a new bed with a um, storage base on it, which is fantastic. So at least we got all that done. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, there'll be more stuff. I'll see. I might post a video every couple of days. See how we go. And if you've got any questions, feel free to post. Bye.